Tonight's forecast, a freeze is coming. Quickly, transfer the gold to this truck. Sorry, boys, but we got here first. Let's make a deal. Join me. Together, we can be the most powerful criminals in the world. Hmm, that's a tempting offer. We accept. Just think, Professor Frost. We'll steal a trillion dollars. Then we can retire here. A trillion dollars is nothing to sneeze at. That's why I'm going to take my half and... What do you mean, your half? I did come up with the idea to steal the sub, and I did develop the freeze ray. I am the boss, and I make the rules. You break the rules, and that's why you're going to jail. Come on, come on, give me that. Wait, sir! Wow! It's hot! Who are you? Your old colleague, Victor Freeze. Oh! Please, beg you. You beg? In my nightmares, I see my Nora behind the glass. How I've longed to see that look frozen on you. The advanced circuitry that powers my suit also triples my strength. All who stand in my way must feel the icy touch of death. A touching scene. I would be moved if I were still capable of it. You don't have to do this. Wayne Enterprises helped save your wife's life. I have some people working for me who can... You are just a boy when you lost your family. But you keep trying to create a surrogate family. To destroy you, I need only destroy that beloved surrogate son. Now, the surrogate father. Hello, Gregory. Victor! Your secretary wouldn't give me an appointment until next September. Now, is that any way to treat an old colleague? I've got a patient who needs you. She's got a couple of weeks, at best. What? Don't shoot the messenger, Victor. Nothing can save her now short of an organ transplant. Then do it. And this is gonna cost you. I mean, the kind of service we're talking about here doesn't come cheap. I see you haven't changed. Gold? I've been like this for nearly 50 years. I have become what many men have dreamed of. An immortal. And yet, there hasn't been a day I haven't thought about death. What if I said I could give you life? A normal life? Ah. An incredible mind like yours deserves a body. Dr. Lake and I have taken every precaution, Victor. Save your breath. I am neither afraid nor capable of being comforted by a banal words. <laughs> Liquid nitrogen, do not touch. <laughs> I was expecting someone with a little more flair. Such a chilly reception, Batman. Ah, my eyes! Allow me to pick your frozen brain. K 
Okay, where's your friend? You want to play it that way? Okay. Now! You all right? Better than them, anyway. Who's in there? The name is Freeze. Mr. Freeze. Another two-bit gadget villain from Gotham City. Great galaxies! This is his power play. He's taking what belongs to your paw. Traitor! Amateur. You can't possibly hope to beat me at my own game. How about we trade dance partners? Deal! My suit is breached! Can't survive unless... I was in the middle of my story! Soon, I'll have the most valuable trophies in the world. And the city at the mercy of a new Ice Age. You poor deluded fool. <laughs> no more, Mr. Ice Guy. <laughs> what the hell? Frozen, shining, perfect. A wasteland paradise. Cold enough to ditch the suit yet? Yes. Finally free. I'm glad you are here to see the beginning of all this, Oswald. But your usefulness has come to an end. We're here to stop you, Batman. And just how do you two plan on doing that? With a little help from our friends. Many thanks for accepting my invitation. Like I'd miss an opportunity to hang with THE Mr. Freeze. Truly, Killer Frost, it is I who am humbled by your mastery over cold. I fear heat while you are able to reverse it. But really, I'm here to serve. Oh, that's good, because freezing all of Gotham in order to rule it is something I do not feel I can accomplish. Without you. No! You freeze! Mr. Freeze! Freeze! Clayface! Take this guy out! Get them, men! Or it's curtains! you had enough ice freeze.
I haven't been to a comedy club in years. And they say Everest is a climb. Look out! Allow me to break the ice. Let's kick some ice. An enticing offer. You are not sending me to the cooler. I'm afraid that my condition has left me cold to your pleas of mercy. Frosty!